Welcome, welcome back to our next lesson, everyone. We are going to sing a little bit today, um, review some of the things that we've been practicing, and then we'll have a quick seesaw activity at the end. So, um, for today, uh, I got my guitar here, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna play. I've been able to practice a little bit over uh, while we've been home, and let's see how it goes. So, uh, repeat after me. Could you sing? Do, do, re, re, mi, so. And could you sing? So, la, la, so, so. And how about? Mi, so, so, la, mi, so, so. And how about? So, la, so, la, mi. Excellent. And how about um, our Great Big House in New Orleans song? We learned, we just started learning this a couple weeks ago. Um, last week we did Chrome Music Lab, so it's been a little while. I'm going to sing it first. You just get to listen. You can keep the steady beat somewhere if you'd like. Great Big House in New Orleans, 40 stories high. Every room that I've been in, filled with pumpkin pie. All right, I'll sing. You sing back to me. Ready? Great Big House in New Orleans, 40 stories high. Could you um, try singing it with me all the way through? Remember, great big house in New Orleans, 40 stories high. Every room that I've been in, filled with pumpkin pie. All right? So I'm going to sing it. You sing it with me. Ready? One, two, ready and go. Great big house in New Orleans, 40 stories high. Every room that I've been in. Filled with pumpkin pie. All right. Now, I eat pumpkin pie a little bit, but I have other kinds of pie that I love, like cherry pie is my favorite. So this time, I'm going to sing it with filled with cherry pie. If you have your own favorite kind of pie that is so delicious that if you had all any choice that you could, you would have you would choose this kind of pie. Could you put your kind of pie in there? And you might have to do it a little bit um, quickly depending on what kind of pie. So if you have apple pie or cherry pie or um, pecan pie or something like that, it'll fit. Filled, oh sorry, filled with cherry pie. But if you have like French silk pie, filled with French silk pie. Oh, you have to change the rhythm a little bit. Or some people have said, I'm not trying to think of one that um, changes. Um, strawberry rhubarb is a, a kind of pie that some people like. So filled with strawberry rhubarb pie. Oh, you have to like say it really fast so it fits in the song. All right, see if you can fit your favorite kind of pie in the song. Ready? One, two, ready and go. Great big house in New Orleans, 40 stories high. Every room that I've been in, filled with cherry pie. All right, cool. What if I played? Could you sing it all on your own? Ready? And try it out again. For a quick second and I'm gonna get my tubano over here now we've been practicing some rhythms do could you say do and clap while you do it ready go ready how about this one that would be do daddy say do daddy cool try this do do one that I'm gonna tell you is how about 
this time I'm going to play uh, two rhythms. Well, I'm going to play one rhythm at a time, and you see if you can add the rhythm language on. I'm not going to say it this time. So this is called decoding. Can you decode this rhythm? Ready? Here it is again. All right. That was do, do, daddy, do, do. Listen again. Say, say it with me. Do, do, daddy, do, do. See how that fit? All right, how about this one? We'll do one more like that. Uh, here we go. Here it is again. You can always just clap it back to me and then try to add that rhythm language on. It's either do or do dotty, so we don't have that many choices right now. Ready? That was do dotty do dotty. So, we're going to do one more quick thing, and that is I'm going to play a rhythm, and I want you to clap a rhythm back to me that is different from what I play. So now we're not echoing. You're not doing the exact same thing as me. Now you are making up your own, and it doesn't have to be totally different. It just has to be different in some way from what I did. Okay, so let's try it out. to do still clap and say something back but make it different that's the goal of that activity all right well that's all we're going to do for today quick and easy but for seesaw could you um, go over there i'm going to put the words for great big house in new orleans up and i want to hear you sing it with um with your own favorite kind of pie okay so whatever your favorite kind of pie is, put that in there. Let me hear it. Use your best singing voice. Make sure it's a little bit higher than your speaking voice. Great big house in New Orleans. And you can always um, replay this video and listen to the song again if you need to. All right. Uh, I will see you again next week. And have a great week, everyone. Bye.